So in this whole video, I'm going to show you how to find a printer that's actually compatible with your Chromebook. Now in the past, you'd go to the store or go to the online website and you'd be looking for your printers. And if the printer had said Google Cloud Print Ready on it, you go, all right, I found the right printer. You'd buy that one and you know for a fact that that printer would be compatible with your Chromebook. The thing is, Google has discontinued that service. So you say, oh no, what are we going to do? Well, the good news is that now Chromebooks are compatible to all printers that are IPP. That is Internet Printing Protocol. So if you have a printer that has IPP on it or Internet Printing Protocol on it, then it'll work. Now I have made a video on actually how to connect your IPP printer with your Chromebook and that's listed above me up there. So anytime um, you can click up there to get into that video and I take you step by step on how to actually connect your Chromebook with your printer. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you a different websites and that actually have a listing of all the IPP uh, ready printers out there and before we get into that I would like to remind everyone that hey if you like these types of videos please click on the thumbs up that really helps the channel greatly and if you haven't done so already please click on the subscribe button all right so let's get into those IPP printers so I'm going to take you through a number of different websites and I'm also going to show you some recommended printers out there that actually do a good job of printing from your Chromebook now the very first site that I want to take you to is right here at IPP Everywhere. And I'll have a link to all these different websites down in the description so that you can actually find those and work with these yourself. So if you look at this website, you'll notice there um, it has different filters there in the middle. It says that I can look at it through uh, to find a different model or make. I can look at different sizes. Is it color or black and white? One or two sided printing? and then optional staple or punch. And then of course, we want to go with the IPP there. So what we're going to do is look at this list here. And if you notice, I'm going to click on the make there. And it has HP and Lexmark and a few others there, but the list is kind of small, unfortunately. And I wish the list was larger, but uh, don't worry. We have other websites to visit besides this one. So let's just see how this works here. Let's say that you wanted to find a HP. So I click there and right away it comes up with all the HP models that have IPP on them. As you can see there, it's a long list. Also up there, it says 643 different printers. So if you wanted to find one of these, you can then go in and let's say I wanted this laser jet pro click it and it would take me to the actual HP information website and give me more information about that HP color laser. So that's one of the very first resources that I wanna share with you there, IPP everywhere. So next we're gonna go into Canon and look at all the Canon printers that are compatible to your Chromebook. There it is. So all these will print and some of these will actually scan from your Chromebook and there's all the model numbers. Now, an easy way, let's say that you wanted to actually buy one of these, an easy way to do that would be just to highlight one of these models, use a shortcut Control C, and then go to shopping websites such as Amazon, and then go up into the search box and use the shortcut Control V to paste that in to the search box and then do a search for that particular model. Next, we're gonna take you to the HP uh, customer support page there. And of course, working uh, HP printers with your Chromebook. And it's kind of nice because it shows you step-by-step -step on how to add your printer to your Chromebook. But if we go down the list here, it says find the list. And it says to find your printer uh, that's compatible, use the IPP Everywhere page. So those two are linked. Next, I'm going to go into Epson printers. And so here, we, if we scroll down this page here from Epson, you can actually see all of the printers that are compatible. So the way they list it is they show you all the printers and all the 
all in one printers. And then you can have different choices of models there. We go next is the photo printers. So if you're looking for a photo printer that's compatible to a Chromebook, there's that list there. Next we have printers and all-in-ones for work. And those are usually more expensive, but they print quicker, which is kind of nice. So if you want something for the office, you have a very good listing there. And the next we have photo printers for work or large format printers. So it's actually a very good listing there of the good variety that you can actually have for uh, Epson printers that will work with your Chromebook. And the next one we're going to go into is Brother. So if you like Brother printers like I do, then here's the actual list of all of the printers that are compatible to your Chromebook there. And the one that I actually use people to ask, I use the Brother HL3170 CDW printer. And that is a color laser printer. Uh, when I bought them, they were on sale for around $100. When I go to Amazon right now, they're a couple hundred dollars to up to $400 or more dollars for that particular printer. So they are kind of expensive, but they are great. They print quickly, and I haven't had any problems with using it in the last few years here. Again, looking at the brother list there, you can actually go down the list and see there's a good list of model numbers there that you can choose from. So I've shown you a number of different websites that you can actually go through and find compatible models to uh, shop for. Now what I'm going to do is actually find some uh, printers that I actually recommend that are currently on sale. And the very first one we have is this one right here. This is less than $100 and it's the HP DeskJet 2755E. It's a wireless color printer and it's all in one and you actually get free ink with that one there and it's only about $75 and if you're a Prime member you get it with free shipping which is kind of nice. Now one thing that you know I always tell my students whenever before you buy something make sure you go through the ratings and through all of the uh, questions there and look to make sure that you know you're going to be happy with that printer. Um, if we look at it, it has 4.3 out of 5 stars, so many, many people actually very much like this printer, and there's 2,471 ratings, so that's, so far it's sounding really good for that one. It is listed as far as when I went to the IPP Everywhere page, I was able to find that one. So let me show you how I did that one. What I'm going to do is I'm going to highlight the model name, go control C to copy it, go back to the IPP Everywhere page, and I'm going to use control F as a shortcut. When you use control F, by the way, at any website, it brings up the find um, option there so we can actually find text. And then I'm going to go control V and paste that text up there. And let's find it there. So I'm going to go next. And there it is, the HP DeskJet 2755E all-in-one. So we know for a fact it is compatible with our Chromebooks. Next, we're going to look at a Brother printer. And this one is more expensive. So if you have a bigger budget, this one's $530. It's the Brother HLL. 83 CDW series business wireless color laser printer. Now, the reason why I recommend this one here is because it does print very, very quickly. It has a very good, clear, and crisp touchscreen, so it's it's very easy to set up and it allows for mobile printing. So there you have it. Now you have a list of really good websites you can go to and do your research to find a compatible printer with your Chromebook. And again, if you like these types of videos, please do click on that thumbs up icon there and leave a comment or a question down below. And I'll be sure to try to answer that as soon as I can. By the way, if you don't know, my name is Mr. Barry and you're watching the YouTube channel called Selma Teacher 7. Thank you very much and bye bye. <laughs> I just realized I got paid to say I pee pee everywhere. <laughs> okay, everyone. 
Bye-bye. <laughs>